Hey guys, it's Louise here and welcome back to my channel. So today we have episode 6 of The Mandalorian. Um, it's... I, I, again, I'm excited. I'm always excited for every episode every week and I can't wait to see what kind of adventures we go on or what kind of shit we get up to. I don't know. Let's Let's get into the episode and see. It is time to retake Mandalore. Wonder if this episode's just gonna be Bo going off and finding people. Sabine? Are we gonna go recruit Zeb and Callus for help? This is our Callus episode. Clown emoji if I'm wrong. <laughs> Okay. Imperial ship. Who's Imperial ship? Oh, it's a big boy. Okay, but if it doesn't have the Khmer logo underneath it, then I don't want to know. Hail, Imperial friends. We're making our way to do business in the mid rim. I recognize that person's voice. I'm aware of any local warlords that required payment. We are not Imperial either. Oh, okay. Well, that was we not expected. Okay. And sadly, I know it was for love. But my job is not to judge, but simply to complete the tasks for which we were hired. I won't go. We love each other. Sorry. Got to bring you back home, what is going on? That, you can do whatever you want. What is this? I can't go back to that wretched palace. Don't make us. This feels like some sort of like theater, theater show. Cap, please. Like, are we watching like Romeo and Juliet in space? To go with them. No, I love you. Please go. I, I can't destroy everything I've built for a childish fling. But you what is happening? Know. We knew fate was not on our side, and I will always. Cordyceps? I'll see you again. It's a long ride home. I thought Mandalorians were honorable. We are, kid. All it takes is a few credits. <laughs> Valid. <laughs> I, 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 I... Okay. Just give us the queen back. What we want is the queen. I'll land outside the fleet's perimeter. Probably best if we go in on foot. Welcome to Plasia 15. No, the what? Island's only remaining direct democracy. You will be guided uh. on the assigned <laughs> path. Automated guidance. So much for subtlety. Automated guidance. Oh my god. What happened? They've taken control of the ship. What? This just reminds me of the dome on raft. That's all I can think of, honestly. Just not on water. Oh my goodness, it's like a it's a it's a it's a wish version of triple zero and BT. <laughs> oh. Your guess is as good as mine. God, they look so good together. Just both of them just look so fucking good. Oh, I love them both. Perhaps at a later time. Please do not attempt to leave the vehicle. This is not a request. Oh, Jesus. No, thank you. Give us a warning first. What the fuck? Din's just like, yeah, cool, whatever. And Bo's like, the fuck? <laughs> and then Grogu's like, <laughs> I've never been here before. Have you? Bo strutting her walk. God damn. Oh, look at that armor. Look at the guards. Damn. It's a party. We do love a party. Damn. Oh my god, there's so many. Guess. Frog people! Mandalorian. There's frog people! I hope you sip sip. Come, please. Is that Jack Black? <laughs> no way. The Did they just. In the, room. I was the bantha in the room. A facilities planning our Holy shit, it's Jack Black! The new what the fuck? Program, Where did that come from? Rebuild Plaza 15. You were Imperial? He was. <laughs> <laughs> Could I perhaps hold the baby, please? 
Oh, she's such a mood. She doesn't take kindly to strangers. Oh. <laughs> he did not hold back. First time in our history. But because of this, did knowing that Jack Black was an Imperial is great. I'd like to speak to these. I love that. Our constables are ill-equipped to confront battle droids. Battle droids? <laughs> Former battle droids. They've been rehabilitated for civic duty. We thought they were. Obviously not. You see where we're going here? You want us to eliminate your droid problem? Exactly. I mean, it's only battle droids. They're not an so issue. Hold on there, Your Majesty. We didn't agree to have you. Princess Crease, you punch him in the face, they're dead. Not a... Unless Unlike it's B2s. Outside your city. Okay, what I <laughs> <laughs> She's <laughs> just... <laughs> excursion would be viewed as an act of diplomacy. <sighs> oh, what the fuck? Whoa! That's epic. I love this. <gasps> oh, no. I was right to be fearful of him all along. I knew it. I told you. I knew it. Why not turn them He's off? scary. Who's in charge of that? Then what do you want from us? I recognize this man from somewhere as well. I need to check the credits after. Until we can fix the problem. See what happens when you rely on droids. Are you taking this personally? Just pointing it out. <laughs> Let's just finish this. <laughs> oh, Din. I am Bo-Katan Kreese. That's a B2. Who's in charge? Dude, there was a, there was a, there was a... I am Mandalorian Din Djarin, friend of Ugnaught. It looked like there was a protocol droid that was black and... Questions and help us with our triple task. zero? I have spoken. Oh, I have spoken. Thank you for your hospitality oh. and for sharing your table with us. Damn, this is fucking awesome. Since the Clone Wars. She said it. She said the words. She said the words. Of them look suspicious. <laughs> All of them. Suspicious. Yeah. <laughs> oh, this is a restricted area. Oh, the voice. You are to vacate immediately. Show me your identification, please. Roger, Roger. We're here on behalf of the Duchess to investigate the droid malfunctions. I saw the report. There are no droid malfunctions. Rest assured, I've had the entire line of loaders undergo maintenance protocols as a safety measure. Din, certification is Din, are you fire. okay? Din, uh, bestie. If I were you. Why is that? They were. Yeah. Uh, what are you doing? Din. You shouldn't phase them. Uh, sir. Excuse me. Din, what are you doing? Oh! Oh! Din just got taken out by a B2. Bruh, what is this? This is amazing. Holy shit! Holy fuck! Dude, Bo using her jetpack in this situation is awesome. Dude is insane! What? What has he been smoking? This is a crime scene. <laughs> Damn, that was badass, though. You kicking droids? I figured out which one was malfunctioning, didn't I? Oh, Din. Now let me do it mine, okay? Gonk. This is the address. Oh, I'm so vibing with this place. I'm here for it. So many droids. It's droid heaven. I love it here. Wow, he's so shiny and blue. Oh, oh, I eat oh. Hello. Bombastic side eye from every droid in the room. I don't think they get many of our kind here. No compliance with planetary 
If you don't start answering questions, I'll yank your memory circuit and dissect it back at the lab. <laughs> Damn! Nobody leaves. Didn't pull out all the stops. Of course, it's the protocol droid that's like, word. Bye! Stay where I can see you. Some droids on Plazia date back to the Separatists. The New Republic would send them to scrap. But here on Plazia, they are given a second chance. Human life is so short. They don't ask that much of us. Organics created us. It's the least we can do. My heart. <laughs> Droid supremacy. Ah, oh, my heart is so happy, and there's a gunk in here as well. Ah. Record of what each of the ordered. These are the remains of the latest malfunctioning droid. Oh, no! PTSD from that droid! PTSD! PTSD! I knew not to trust it! I knew it! I knew it! I knew it! They're dangerous and they should not exist! They're still active. I will never not get excited when I see Din use the Darksaber. Commissioner Hellgate. I mean, it was already suspicious enough that he didn't press the red button. We have some questions for you. You programmed them to disrupt an attack. You're coming with us. Everyone freeze! I didn't give up to the Empire. And I won't give up to you. You're a separatist. Separatist is a pejorative term. I support democracy. Count Dooku was democracy. A he was cut short in his Oof. time by the Jedi forces. Oh, man, it's just really name dropped Count Dooku. Oh, politics. <laughs> Valid. Has she still got Grogu? She does. Oh my god, Grogu has a new bestie. <gasps> well done, Grogu! He helped her. That's so cute. Wholesome. Dude, I love these security. The security guards are awesome. Like tripper armor. With capes. And to this little one, I grant knighthood. Man's is being knighted? You are now a knight of the ancient order of independent regencies. Oh, Bo is so proud of him. Until our paths meet again. That's so fucking cute. Oh, you are! You are! Oh! Damn, there's a lot of them. Ma'am. Then I challenge you. One warrior to another. I do. Oh! Oh, she's gonna win. Come on, it's Bo-Katan. Oh! Shit! Damn. Give her the dark saber. Throw it. Throw it. I don't know if she's allowed, but throw it. Oh, oh that was cool. Ma'am. Yes, please. Yes. You would never be the true leader of all people. You wouldn't even take the dark saber from me. Din Djarin took the creed and chose to walk the way. Just as our ancestors did. He is every bit the Mandalorian that they were. But according to our ways, the ruler of Mandalore must possess the dark saber. Then she shall have it. 
Captain. This belongs to you. It's not a gift to be given, no matter how well intended. This is the second time she's been offered it by someone. It's, it's like Sabine is like, here you go. <laughs> and Din's like, here you go. Oh, is he gonna fight her? While exploring Mandalore, nope. I was captured. Oh. This blade was taken from me. She defeated the enemy that defeated me. Um. We'd had suspicions about that being a thing, but weren't sure because we don't know the rules. Would it not belong to her? Would it not belong to her? It would. Oh my god, can we see her lifted up above her head, please? I return this blade to its rightful owner. Yay! As much as I love seeing Din with it, I do think Bo deserves it. Yes, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it, do it! Or put it downwards, I guess. Oh, Queen! Queen, let's go! Oh my god, it's so good to see her like that! Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Bro, why does Mandalorian have to go and put me onto the Bad Batch screen? That is so sad. I am so fucking sad. What the fuck? That is rude. That is so rude, Disney. What the hell? Well, that episode certainly was something. The start of it... I... I honestly, I have no words for it. The start was a little bit like, what What the fuck? Like, why? I don't... I, I don't care to comment on it. Um, The rest of the episode, I just... I don't care where they are, what they're doing, who they're with... But I just will eat up any scene of Bo-Katan fighting. No matter what she's doing or who she's fighting, she is beauty. She is grace. And I want to sit... Nope. <laughs> we're not, we're not going <laughs> to... Anyway. Um, <laughs> I can't believe I just fucking went to say that. I can't believe my brain went there. Um, anyway, Bo-Katan is just, like, like, I, I, I will happily admit that I was never, like, the biggest fan of her in, like, the Clone Wars and Rebels. Like, I never, not that I didn't like her, I just, you know, you have those characters, you're like, okay, she's cool, and then you move on. Like, she wasn't ever one of, like, my favorite characters or anything, but Mandalorian has, like, changed that in so many ways. Like, just seeing her in full action and giving her so much more depth, depth to her character... And the way that she fights and the way she uses her jetpack and the way she just speaks and the way she looks and the way she... I just everything about her is just wonderful. And I am obsessed with her. I think she's incredible. Um, and it makes it even better when she's with Din because obviously Din... Din is top tier. Like, he is, like, top fucking tier of a character. Um, and just seeing them both together, the way they were, like, running after the droid and the way they were fighting and... It was just great. It was absolutely great. And seeing Bo at the end with the dark saber made me so happy. That was awesome. But I, I, Jack Black and Christopher Lloyd. I know I said during I was like, oh, I recognize this guy. Who is he? But I didn't realize it was fucking Christopher Lloyd. That's what I mean about like the last episodes. I, I so I, I struggle so hard to put names to faces. Like I'm like I know that guy, and it could be someone like one of my favorite actors of all time. And I'm like I don't know his name can't fucking remember like i knew i recognized him but holy shit that was really cool to have him in star wars i know it was like rumored beforehand but it's a case of i like to not believe rumors until it actually happens so the fact it happened is pretty damn cool we got that was such a good cast like we had jack black and christopher lloyd like what that that's that's pretty freaking cool i actually need to see who the voice of the person at the beginning was because i recognized her voice as well it might just be nobody that i know but i, I need to find out Okay, there's nothing really that sticks out to me, so it's probably just a recognizable voice. But, um, yeah, it was it was a, it was an interesting episode. Like, I do, I did mostly love like the fight scenes and the chasing after the droid. I think that was cool. And honestly, the droid bar was so freaking cool. Like, you guys know how much I love droids. So having like that little like that little moment of like droid emotions and droid supremacy, where they're like, we don't want to be replaced by humans. You know, like, I I I. I love that. I love that they have their little area where they just uh, droids just gather and they just ha chill and have fun and have drinks and stuff. I absolutely love that. Um, that is somewhere that I would want to go. Like I, I would be their protector. 
Um, but yeah, it was it was a, it was an interesting episode. Um, definitely, I still enjoyed it. It was very good, um, and I can't wait to see. We've only got two episodes left, which makes me really sad. Um, but now Bo is in charge of the dark saber. She's in charge of all these Mandalorians. So now we're gonna bring them back, and then we're gonna go find Sabine. Uh, I'm still holding on to hope. I feel like honestly, Sabine might end up honestly being like an after credits thing. Um, or we'll see, like, Thrawn's ship. Like, we'll just see, like, a ship going over and you'll just see, like, the Chimera thing underneath it. Like, you know the way, obviously, they set up the Book of Boba Fett at the end of The Mandalorian, like, it was, like, an after credit scene. I feel like, um, maybe we'll see something like that that sets up Ahsoka. Um, because by the time that episode will air, it will already be past Star Wars Celebration. So I feel like maybe we'll see something at Celebration and then they'll show something more in the end of the trailer uh or sorry in the end of the episode i have no idea um but we only have two episodes left and i'm i don't know what to do when it's done like i need an ahsoka release date so that i know what like i i know where i'm at because i don't know what to do i don't know what i'm supposed to react to because we've like ha we've been blessed with so much star wars content recently that i'm like well what, what do i watch now well what do we do um, although Jedi Survivor is coming out very, very soon, so I will be playing that on my Twitch channel, and I will also be uploading it to YouTube, so keep an eye out for that. Um, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I am gonna edit this and finish packing, because I leave for Star Wars Celebration tomorrow. If you haven't seen my previous video, I talk about, like, my schedule, my plans and stuff for Celebration. Um, so if you want to watch that and find out where I'm gonna be, then make sure you check that out. Um, and I hope to see some of you guys there. So thank you for watching and I will see you guys in the next video. So peace and may the force be with you. I have spoken. Dun, 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 dun.